Hey guys, it's Jen and um, I'm the author of the Aromatherapy Insight Cards and I am incredibly blessed to be here today with the artist of the Aromatherapy Insight Cards because you know what, I, I wrote the book, absolutely. However, I did not, <laughs> I'm not the artistic one. So I want to talk today to, I want to introduce the beautiful Karen Osborne to everybody because um, she's the woman behind this and you know, it's, it's a whole process how we got to do this. And we were chatting about it and I said, we need to record this story. It's been huge. So first off, g'day, Karen. Morning, lovely lady. How are you? I'm really, really, really good. And I'm excited. Thank you for taking a few minutes to have a chat to me. It's crazy. We were yeah. just saying that it's 16 years since we published the Insight Cards. It is, it's crazy. What it, that's, how did where'd those years go? I know. And, and if we thought 16 years ago, what we we look like in the future we have no idea <laughs> <laughs> no we didn't <laughs> but you know I'm, I'm really happy that we're at this point 16 years because I think we've been at 16 years of experience and life wisdom and everything to these cards again and it's just awesome how individually as women we've grown in that time you know and we've yeah. been there. Yeah, you're right. And, and we caught up recently and I love now that you're living closer to me, which is really cool. We've both yeah. moved down from North Queensland. Um, but I love that, you know, we we're talking recently about the cards and just look at them, guys. They, uh, the paintings are spectacular, just amazing. So, you know, we we're talking recently about, about that, you know, where the cards were and the life that they've had for the last 16 years. And it's like, and even myself, like I've leave, let them sit for a couple of years and, uh, and it's like they've called me so strongly in the last few months to just come out again. So I'd been recording this video series and, uh, and we were talking about the fact that, yeah, they have, it's like the, the energy's back in, in, it, I, I almost feel like, uh, the world's ready for them now more than they were 16 years ago, if that makes sense. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, I think one of the other really cool parts of this story is that you called me as I was driving down the coast on my move. So literally during the move to say you're doing this, that was just, it just blew my mind. You know? um, so it is that it's about the energy being right and ready and aligned and I'm convinced of it. Yeah, yeah totally. So um, let's talk about first how this even happened as a project, because uh, a thing that people, a lot of people have, would have no idea is the fact that like, we knew each other this much. Yeah. You know, you'd been a customer of my aromatherapy shop in, uh, in Townsville. Yeah. Um, and, we, and we knew of each other. I knew of this little bit that you had an artistic background. I knew you more as a nurse. Yeah. So I really didn't know that side of you. And uh, there was another customer of the shop, Jill, who, um, and if she watches this, hey, Jill, uh, who said to me, come on, Jen, you've been talking about this for ages. When are you actually going to do this? And I went, you know what? That's it. It's done. I'm going to do it. And I remember writing a post-it note. I knew I wanted to call them insight cards. And I wrote a post-it note that said insight cards. And I stuck it, you know, in my diary at the time and just kind of went out to the universe and went, it's going to happen. Now, in my mind, originally, I thought, well, I'm going to travel around the world and I'm going to take photos of the plants in their natural state. <laughs> and that would become the insight cards. Yeah. And that was like, that was just never going to happen at that time. Um, but then two, three days later, I got a phone call from you. Yeah, and I had been studying aromatherapy and I was, like, I was just thinking there's so many, you know, there's just so many essential oils out there and so much to know about them. And I was going I'm so visual, like where, if I had a card that I could look at that had this energy about them, then I'd remember that. And so I rang up Jen and said, like, where's the cards? I want to buy them, you know? And, um, and it just started like that, didn't it? Yeah, and, and I, I remember just going, oh, wow, okay, well, you can paint them. Yeah. <laughs> <And it> was, <laughs> okay, well, how did you say that? And it was, the timing was just perfect because I'd done cards before, you know, done that set of um, Here's to and Animal Wisdom cards. I knew what was involved. I <laughs> guess I knew I was biting off a whole chunk of work, but, you know, I had some idea of uh, where to start and where it goes, so it just grew. It was amazing, yeah. It was. And so I went about, I'd been working with the oils intuitively. I'd done some trainings with Robbie Zek around, in, around um, aromatic kinesiology. And I'd been working with the emotional side of oils uh, for a, a lot of years. And 
was really called more to that emotional side. And I too wanted a tool that was going to be just simple that people could use. But yeah, I'm not the artisty kind of girl. So um, I said, cool. I, my brief I gave to you was just to paint the energy of the oils. I had no idea that you were going to paint these amazing women. <laughs> um, I just gave you that brief. So I, I gave you some oils and off you went. Yeah. <laughs> and, and like a year later we connected and, and, and I'd been writing the book while you'd been, you know, the book wasn't even written. Yeah. Like I was writing that while you were painting. Yeah. And synchronicity is amazing. Tell us yeah, about. It was friend. amazing. And it just, you know, so we were in two separate places, 500 kilometers apart, I guess. And yeah. we just did this. Yeah. We did. So what was your <laughs> process? You know, like on a um, daily or so weekly, yeah. how does an artist work? Oh, so, you know, how I work um, and how I worked with these is really intuitive, um, you know, pretty much let the universe come through me is how I like to do it. So I got this gorgeous box of oils. You know, when you open a box of oils, that's like Christmas. It's, it's just, you could just go, ah, the, the smell and whatever. So, but I just started, you know, pick up um, an oil and sit with it and smell it and put it on and... Um, just basically um, resonate with with that oil and what I got from it. And then I did have this theme, and I wanted um, I wanted women to come through because it was about honouring the um, the lineage of women healers that have gone before us. So yeah. there's an amazing lifetime and lifetime of, of women healers. So bringing that energy in as well. So then trying to you know to merge that picture of if if we had a, a vision of what that energy would look like that I'm getting from this oil what would be the sort of woman that portray that, you know, what aspect of, of a woman today would portray, um, portray that oil. And that's, that's how I come up with, with the different ones. So if you want to hold one up, I can talk to it. Give me a, give yeah. Me a well, Mei Chang's on the top of the pack. So let's go to Mei Chang. Oh, Mei Chang. So what's the energy there? I can't even read it, Jen. Oh, sorry. Okay. Um, so Mei Chang is all about, you know, getting rid of the poor me's. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what an appropriate one to pull up for me today. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and that's exactly There's how. No coincidences. <laughs> yeah. So here's this woman. You know, she's she's so strong, and she's just looking forward. I see um, into the into the future, and it's about you know what's it coming. It's she has this sort of magic energy that she's bringing forward and a reliance on self. So thanks for that one, Jen. <laughs> All right, no coincidences. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> It, the, uh, a lot of people have said over the years, you know, why, why 42? And I muscle tested everything for this. I muscle tested what oils uh, wanted to be do, you know, wanted to be in the deck. Um, it came up with 42. I was not in control of that. I have such trust in the energy of life that these were the oils that came through. It wasn't 43. It wasn't 41. It was just 42. That's what came through. Yeah. And even muscle tested, you know, which one, which was sandalwood that wanted to be on the cover of the deck i i just believe in in yeah in, in muscle testing so much it was in, the whole thing was such an interesting project to be part of and you know it, it's blessed so many people around the world for so long now which has been yeah it, it's really cool and i'm excited to be you know to be bringing it forward now which is really cool so what's next for you you've moved down both of us we lived in north queensland i was in towns or you were up mackay way I'm now on the Gold Coast and you're on the sun, Sunshine Coast. We're, we're closer together, but we're still not right together. Yeah. You know, I know you're, you are so passionate about your horses as well as your, your art. What's next for you? Yes, so horses have really re-entered my life. had them when I was younger. So in the last 12 months, um, horses re literally re-entered my life in a massive, massive way. So two, um, two big X-race horses that um, I'm rehabilitating and, and certainly using aromatherapy through that journey and they love them. I can tell you the first time I took one out to the paddock, I just thought, I'll see what happens with this horse. Took Roman chamomile out, put it on my hands and he like he licked it off my hands. Just stood there and licked it, licked it, licked it. And I went, guess you like that one today. <laughs> <laughs> so it sort of started this process um, but what's coming through for me really strongly, what I'm going to do next is a set of um, equine um, intuitive cards. So bringing that horse wisdom and the horse energy to the world, which I think is really being birthed into the world in a really strong way at the moment. So horses are bringing 
the gifts that they've always had in, but we're now starting to look at them as more than animals that can just, you know, we can jump on their back and ride around and have a lot of fun that they're actually bringing this massive healing energy in. So I'm getting ready to explore that. Yeah. Very, very cool. I love it. There's just so much, there's so much excitement around energetic work. There always has been. However, I think the world's more receptive and ready for it now, which is really cool. And horses, all animals are energetic beings, the same as we're energetic beings. But people get so damn stuck in their head, they totally forget to, to sit in that kind of vibe of what it is. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So, you know, and I notice um, I can be really big day, busy day, and I can just be in that sort of uh, mood, go out, arrive at the horses within 10 minutes. I'm like, oh, I'm good again, you know. Yeah. Thank you, guys. <laughs> well, that's exciting. I'm really cool. That's, yeah, really cool that you're off on that journey. And yeah. I'm excited that the insight cards have come through again in such a strong way. The question has been asked um, a couple of times over, uh, recently again is, you know, will there be a second deck of these and that? And I've muscle tested it and it hasn't. It's been like, no, nah, they're complete. But they're, I think they're just meant to have this, this kind of rebirth, which is exciting. Yeah, and I think we even looked at that and touched on that because we did a couple like, of times over the years yeah you know do they need do the images need a little extra or whatever and it just i agree they're complete how could you change that that is so <laughs> complete, like really spectacular yeah. so karen i just want to thank you again it's uh it's been quite a journey and i'm looking forward to the next 16 years with these insight cards and um this is this is an amazing woman, everybody, an amazing artist. She's residing now on the sunny coast and is going to be getting back into her teaching through 2017 again. So if you're wanting to, I'm just going to dob you in your look of shock on your face, but this is true, she is. <laughs> so um, if anyone wants to contact her around that kind of stuff, um, yeah. yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. That's, Thank you. That's really, really awesome. And I look forward, you know, sometimes I think we'll we'll end up together doing some stuff with these cards as well, which is I'm great. I'm certain. I'm certain. So watch out for that in 2017, guys. I reckon yeah. we absolutely will create, you know, a retreaty kind of process around that. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. Awesome. awesome. All right. Thank you so much, Miss Karen. And okay, um, thanks. Guys, Have a great day. get into the art, of, of the art and the healing of what the insight cards, the aromatherapy insight cards are, because they're very, very, very special. Thank okay. You. See ya. Cool. Thanks. Bye, Jane.